You may have seen the pictures on Instagram or the videos on YouTube of these straight top-down shots of products on tabletops for review videos, for unboxing videos, for flat-way photography, or just for product photography, and you want to do that at home. But there's a problem. You don't have a C-stand. You don't want to invest in one. Then they take up room. You could buy a tripod that has a boom arm that extends out and flattens out on it, but you already have a tripod or two or three. I may have too many tripods. Anyway, you already have too many tripods like I do, so you don't want to invest in yet another one for this. But you can buy a tripod boom arm that just adds on to whatever tripod you already have. I decided to explore this, and I found the Terion VB01 Tripod Boom Arm. 40 bucks on Amazon. Why not? Let's give it a shot. Um, ironically, this is the sort of thing that I would need to actually shoot a video like this the way that I want to. So it comes with a thread adapter, in case the quarter inch thread doesn't work out, that should be a 3 8 thread, doubt I'll need that. Uh, a little baggie here with an Allen wrench, instructions in it. sandbag. So when you use anything like a boom, it's going to off-center your tripod, so it's going to try and fall and lean away. A sandbag, you really fill it with sand or anything with weight in it, and you use that as a counterweight to uh, your boom arm. and it pretty much comes already assembled for you. So this is the boom arm. Uh, it doesn't look like a whole heck of a lot, but it does plenty. It actually extends out your camera, so you would put a uh, some sort of ball head or quick release or something right here on this thread. And then this part right here, you would attach to your tripod right there and then it actually has a little pivot point right here that you can walk down and then a slide to show how far to extend it out. Now that sandbag it came with that I showed earlier that took me a second to figure out what it was can attach right here on the opposite end so the weight of the camera doesn't tilt over the actual tripod itself. So fill a sandbag with some sort of weight, sand ideally, and counterbalance it this way. Now this is supposed to be aluminum, it feels pretty solid. This is not plastic whatsoever. This part is plastic, this clip right here is plastic. This piece is actually metal, that feels like it's metal too. Um, Got a little level on it right there. That's neat. I don't know how well you can see that. So here is the boom arm on my main tripod with the ball head attached on one end and the empty sandbag hanging from the built-in hook on the opposite end. The pivoting action is very smooth, making it usable for panning video shots or slide adjustments to still shots. Angling the arm up and down is easy but you'll be limited to making this adjustment for still shots. Metal teeth in the joint here will prevent this from being usable for tilting video shots. Sliding the arm is quick and simple, but the latch isn't perfect and will allow you to suggestively slide the arm even when engaged. It takes some force to do this, though. The ball head screws on and off like you would expect it to. Hooray! So my initial thoughts on this nifty little piece of equipment, I'm pretty happy about it so far. For 40 bucks, it feels like it's pretty well built. It's really lightweight, so whenever it travels with me, I'm not really going to notice it in my kit bag too terribly much. 
It comes with its own canvas sandbag, so I'll be able to counterbalance it once I find some sand or something of the sort to put into that canvas sandbag. And frankly, I think it's going to elevate my photography and my videos. So keep an eye out on my Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube for when I'm doing top-down shots. I think it's also going to be very handy to get those difficult kind of angle shots with my camera where a tripod just doesn't quite reach very well. Um, so yeah, I would definitely recommend it. You'll find a link to it in the description on this video. If you like this video and want to see more like it, please comment down below, like this video, subscribe to my channel while you're at it. Go find me on Facebook, Shifter Photography there as well. And you can find me on Instagram, at Shifter. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.